user database the user database tab is where you manage your viewers you can choose either at the filter all the users or just the VIPs I can also hide the offlines or show them this is the list of all people people that ever joined my channel let's put it off for now next to that is twitch subscriptions I cannot show you this since my channel is not partnered the same counts for the sub manager I can also search for a specific viewer I can do that in the search bar over here the total amount of users is the total amount that ever joined my channel in my channel in this case it's 2283 underneath there you will see a scroll option if you put hide offline off you will see that I have five tabs that I can scroll over let's go to tab 1 as last I can edit a user I can give it a VIP bronze silver or gold and it will auto expire in a specific date that you put in if you do not change this this will go over the course of one month I can also give him moderator rights either level 1 and level 2 what this does I will show in the shorts later I can disable point giveaways to a specific user or remove the exclamation mark top lists the total amount of points can be changed here as well the battle tag option I can show you in a short later as well this is the battle tag for the battle net ID of blizzard entertainment the stream level is a rank the longer a viewer and the more the viewer is in your channel the higher he goes in rank in order to change the ranks I will show you in the shorts later it will also show the join date as last, as last it will show the watch time watched at the moment Alter Arto is 762.8 hours in my channel for specific users and special loyal viewers in your channel you can also make a custom join message and for management purposes you can give it a note I can also manually add points by right mouse clicking and go to the add point option and I can do the same with remove points I can send a personal twitch message if I click on this I will automatically be redirected to the message tab in twitch.tv I can refresh all followers and as last reset the database I disencourage you to use this option since it's very difficult for us to put it back for you if you made a mistake in this this concludes this tutorial.